All right, everyone, welcome back to the uh, unboxing of the replacement Mantis X Blackbeard. I got this on my AR pistol, and so uh, here it goes. Here goes nothing. All right, let's uh, reset it. Seconds. Oh yeah. Overlap oh, yeah. thirty out of thirty. Uh, a lot better. A lot more fun. All right. Thumbs up. Thumbs up, Mantis. It works. It it works. Finally. Thank you, Mantis X. You came through. And uh, I, I will do a comparison. So this one is a success. Good job, Mantis. Hello, everybody. Welcome back. Another episode here of the. Uh, which I think is the Blackbeard. I hope this is the Blackbeard because, uh, as you can see, the label here says Mantis. Mantis. All right, so I've been waiting for a while for this package. It's, uh, what is, it just came today. What is today? Today is uh, Friday. Uh, October 9th so almost uh, almost 30 days I originally got my original mantis the one uh, that didn't work um, let me see September September 12th is it September October yeah September 12th so uh, today's October 9th so almost took just about 30 days anyways um, I've been uh, I have been in contact with Mantis X. I've seen a lot of other videos where uh, Mantis has been showcasing or people have made videos about the Blackbeard. The videos that I've seen are not really satisfactory in my opinion because they don't actually show the Mantis Blackbeard actually working as far as the laser going through the straight through the barrel. So uh, I've been leaving comments and Mantis has been responsive, at least. So I will give them that. They have been responsive. Um, but let's see what's in the box here. And uh, let's find out. Okay. So let's get started. Okay. So uh, here's the box. The box is bigger. That's why it's taking up a lot of the screen here. So let's, uh, let's see what's in here. And yes, it is the Mantis X box. Okay. They, they sent a larger box. Uh, the other one was a lot smaller and here's the here it is now I'm gonna go ahead and grab the other one real quick and we'll compare we'll compare both of them and we'll see like um, how they how they match up here because uh, because here's the other mantis the one that doesn't work that I did a review on. Um, I'm sure you know about that by now. So both the boxes are the same. So let's just put this aside for now, okay? So we're gonna put this aside for now. That's the old box. Here's the new one. And uh, we're gonna see, we're gonna see what, what they did here. Will this work? Um, I'm a little skeptical. Because this old one right here, this old one right here, not only does the laser not come out straight, but the auto resetting trigger stopped working as well. And I'll, I'll show you. I will show you that. But this is the new one. Okay, new one. The new Mantis X. All right, the new Mantis X and the old Mantis X. We're going to compare these here. All right. And the re the reveal, oh, <laughs> just like I did my last video here. All right, so you get the box, another box within a box within a box. For I personally feel that this thing is just overpriced for what it is because uh, 
while I was waiting for this replacement Mantis Blackbeard, I got myself a CERT AR bolt, which works wonderfully well. So here you go. There it is. So the CERT works wonderfully well. And let's have a look at this one. Okay. So there we go. Ugh. All right. So here it is. Um, looks the same. Is this thing centered? Wow. Look at that. There's no... Uh, there's still a seam here, which I really don't like. I really don't like that seam being there, but uh, this is a lot better. Let's zoom in just a little bit. We'll see what you're, I'll show you what I'm talking about. So does this look centered? Yeah, this looks a little bit better centered. This is the windage and that's the elevation right there. Uh, this looks like it's actually on. My other one was there's a separation right here, which I think caused the problem of not being uh, be, being able to adjust the uh, the laser. Okay, um, you get the uh, okay. There's the battery here, so let's zoom back out. So zooming back out, and uh, there you go. You get the battery, which uh, I think, if my memory serves me correct, there's a button right here in which you can push, and it will light up how many how many charges this thing has. Yeah. It says according to this, there's only one one bar, one light. There's three, I think. Um, I guess we could just take a quick look if it works or not. Oh. Okay, this needs to be charged. Um, all right. Anyways, uh, let's let's put this back in here. All right. So, all right. So, it's nothing different about this one because it's pretty much the same. Let's see what's in here. What did they What did they give me? They give me the, the USB with the sticker. Okay, the charger, and then more more stuff. This is the instructions. And then there's a laser academy, which they give you a a full unlimited access. There you go. Laser training unleashed. Full unlimited access to laser academy, some kind of laser academy, which I don't understand how. I don't. It doesn't say anything. It doesn't say anything. Does it? There's no website. There's just a there's a code, but there's no website or anything. But all right. Anyways. Okay, so, all right, so there's the unboxing, okay. And so let's uh, compare it. Now I'm going to go ahead and compare it to um, the older version, and now I'm going to show you. Uh, let's just compare it. Let's just take a look at the two, okay. Let me take this out here, and we'll just compare it compare it so there's the other one and I'll just show you quickly what's wrong with it okay all right so so here's my older one all right and look at look at the gap remember the screw was stripped let's have a zoom in just a little bit okay so the look at that gap compared to this yeah, there's no way this thing was ever going to be straight. There's still a gap right here, which I don't think it hopefully won't matter. But look at look how big that gap is. Jeez, that thing was never going to be straight, no matter what. 
no matter what. And uh, here's the uh, here's a battery for it. Let me see how much charge this thing has. This thing has one bar as well. But this is the older, other other one, my original, that the laser doesn't work and this screws all messed up. And anyways, let's let me show you what I'm talking about. The auto resetting function stop working. Okay, you can see the you can see the laser actually. The laser is turning on. You see that? Laser is turning on. But the auto reset trigger is not working. Okay. Let's see about this one. Let me um I want the laser to be on. Okay. All right. So the laser should be on and Okay, so there is a laser. So this one works, but the you see the auto reset is working. I should probably charge this. All right, so um, all right. Uh, hopefully this is gonna work. I I have another I have a another uh, rifle here, or I, actually it's a pistol. I have a pistol that I'm going to uh, use because my other rifle actually has a cert AR bolt. And uh, please like, share, comment, um, subscribe. I'm going to compare the Blackbeard. All right, I'm going to compare the Blackbeard with the CERT AR bolt. So I'm going to compare the Mantis X Blackbeard bolt to the CERT AR bolt. And I'll give you my opinions on this. Um, so let's let's try to make this work, all right? And give me some time. I'm gonna, I might have to even charge the batteries here. Uh, so hold on. All right, everyone, I'm back. I'm charging one of the batteries. Okay, so this is the one that wasn't very good because you could see that it had the screw stripped. It was very poor quality, and I could never get the, uh, I can't get the uh, thing to come out of the barrel straight. So this thing's a piece of junk, useless, fail. All right, so that's this piece. And also the, <laughs> the resetting trigger stopped working as well. So uh, that's that. So the original piece that Mantis sent me, I had to wait 30 more days on top of the four months. I had to wait when I originally purchased this when it was on pre-sale that was going to be shipped on, it was supposed to be shipped to July. So I ordered it at the end of June. Had to wait all the way up until like August, you know. Anyways, uh, so that's that. And now uh, I'm using my, my pistol no brace <laughs> no brace i'm just using a buffer tube but here it is on my pistol with the um this is a hollow sun yeah i think i'm using a hollow sun uh batteries still work after five years it's still still good and so so using the pistol i have it installed the battery's installed uh it's not fully charged but it, it still works and let's take a look at it shall we wow Look at that, the laser comes out, the trigger resets. I did look through, uh, this This is this is zeroed at, at least up to 25 yards. So, and um, I did look through it and it is about, the laser comes underneath the, the red dot. So it does seem to be pretty straight out of the, let me see, there you go. You could kind of, there, there's the red dot and you can't even, you can't see the laser. Well, you're not gonna see the laser because the laser is gonna be showing on the bottom. But isn't that nice? Look at that. Nice. So I'm gonna put this in my AR pistol uh, this is uh, from Radical Radical Firearms, and uh, I normally I I, re I highly recommend not. Okay, I do not recommend getting a seven-inch barrel uh, AR pistol. They are just not very good. Um, but anyways, it, it, I have the uh, I have the upper, so uh, 
I, I don't think re realistic I'll ever use this seven inch barrel upper. Um, but since I'm inside my house, I'm going to use this as a laser dry fire um, pistol. <laughs> I don't have the SB brace. I understand there's some controversy over the SB brace. Um, but there you go. It works. It, it works. Finally. Thank you, Mantis X. You came through. And uh, I, I will do a comparison. So this one is a success. Good job, Mantis. Um, I do like the resetting trigger because you get that nice little, it actually resets the trigger. So it's, it's, you pull the trigger, the hammer actually is being released. And then as soon as that happens, the hammer is being pushed down to the disconnect, right? The disconnector. You hear that? So you, you do get a feel of really pulling the trigger. Uh, anyways, I will do a comparison of the Blackbeard Mantis. It does work, thank God. Uh, their quality control is kind of poor with this original one. Mantis X, you came through. Good job. Good job. It works. All right. It works. It's awesome. I'm going to do some laser dry firing. I might even put in some, some B-roll teaser just to tease you all, guys. All right? Please like, share, subscribe. Until next time, bye-bye.